Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Paul Leo Jr. And in today's video, uh, I wanted to show you uh, a couple ways in which you can just turn on your PC uh, or laptop with your, um, just with your keyboard. Uh, but more specifically, uh, a wireless keyboard in which you do not have to uh, play with any settings or do anything else. So this is a Logitech, whatever the heck it is. Uh, what was it K400R? And what I really liked about this keyboard was that it has this power button up here on the right that says PC. And what this button actually does is puts the computer into hibernation mode. And in doing so, uh, instead of sleep, which just saves your documents and so forth and your and your session to your memory. Uh, hibernation actually saves all of your information to the hard drive directly and then basically puts the basically turns the entire computer off uh, it uses an extremely minimal or minimum amount of energy so if I just come home and I don't want to wait for my computer to start up um, what I do what I do now is I just leave my computer in hibernation mode and then when I'm ready uh, you know, if I just want to watch, if I just want to lay back and watch, uh, you know, something on the computer, um, I'll have the computer, <laughs> the computer by my bed and I'll just hit this PC button and it'll turn the computer back on. And, you know, I have the touchpad and the keyboard, obviously, so I can do whatever I want, just like I normally would if I was sitting at the uh, computer. So I'll just show you real quick. When I press the PC button, the computer will go into uh, hibernation mode. So you'll see, you should see, uh, there's a light right here. This will go off. Uh, I just heard everything else go off. And then this is, will just blink like that. That's basically, that's really the only amount of uh, power that's being used here. Now, obviously, I could just come home and press this button and so forth. Um, but what I like to do is, you know, at nighttime is if I'm just watching something on the computer, I'm laying in bed and I just have my uh, wireless keyboard with me. So I, you know, have my feet up like so. And now I just press the uh, PC button on this keyboard. And you can see the computer starts back up. It brings me back into <laughs> Windows. I just hit enter and I'm right back in. And then I can just go ahead and do whatever it is I usually do. <laughs> so, um, now that's a nice wireless way to do it. If you're just coming home and you want to just turn on your computer in one shot, you know, while laying in bed and you just want to watch Netflix or whatever it is. Now, um, there's an option on a lot of computers called USB wake support. And it's in the BIOS, which is in, um, you typically see it at the, the beginning, the beginning screen when you're loading up, uh, when you turn on your computer or laptop. Now, if you see this USB wake support option, uh, just make sure it's enabled, and then from there you can do the same thing. Um, you know, you can ob obviously turn on the computer with uh, with any key, or you can use a wireless keyboard to turn on the um, the PC or laptop that way. So that's just another option. The wireless keyboard setting that I just showed you is actually my, let me just save and exit this. The wireless keyboard option is my favorite way because it basically does shut down the computer. Um, now some of the, some wireless keyboards do not have that option of that PC option to actually put it into the, uh, into the hibernation mode, which is my absolute, um, you know, which is my favorite mood. So now the last thing, um, so here's a, here's an example of what I would do. Uh, let's just say I'm laying in bed and I'm watching a TV show. I hit PC. Okay. All right. I'm going to bed. I'm done with this. I hit that. Everything turns off and I'm pretty much good to go. So then that's typically just kind of, excuse my, excuse the mess. But let's just say that's just sitting on my bed. So what I do is I, you know, I'll come home, whatever it is. Oh, uh, okay, I'm just going to watch some TV and so forth. Let me just hit the PC button. 
I do that, and then the computer starts up. I'm right back on here, and then I can just kind of hang out from <laughs> just hang out from the bed, and then start a you know <laughs> continuing a series a series or something like that. So that's one of my favorite ways. <laughs> uh, there's also a program. Now this one is called uh, Wake Me On Land, and I'll put a link in the description. And what this does is it, it actually scans for um, anything that has a MAC address, which is actually in this column right here. I obviously have it, um, you know, completely, <laughs> it's, it's shrunk. Uh, I shrunk it so that obviously you can't see all of the numbers and so forth. But everything that you see that's green means that those specific computers are turned on. So after you run this the first time with all of the computers on, you can actually, um, when that computer is turned off, whatever, you know, whichever computer um, on here that you see, you'll see a red, you know, a red dot here. Um, is, you'll see, okay, that's turned off. So you can actually just hit this guy right here. I could hit this apple. And then from there, I would just actually go to up here where it says wake up selected computers. And by clicking that, that would enable, there's sometimes there's a couple things that you have to play with, but this would actually enable the, um, the Apple device to turn on. Um, but let's just say one of those options did not work. I would go to options and then send the wake on land packet to, and then it would just, I would kind of just go through these options if let's say the first one didn't work and tip eventually uh, one of them will work but usually for any windows uh, device so you see user pc and desktop and uh, hp all those ones would turn on automatically if they were in the red then the actual um, just hitting that little clock up here uh, the wake up select the computer would just turn on the turn on the computer um, on any network, so on, on any computer that is actually on the network. So uh, this was just a really a short video, shorter video to show you, um, <laughs> primarily to show you the wireless keyboard uh, on having that PC uh, hibernation mode uh, button. So uh, definitely comes in handy because a lot of times too is um, I have a a laptop uh, hooked up to my computer via HDMI and it's just hanging out um, you know in the living room so what I'll do from there is like what I just showed you is I'll come home and then maybe sit on the couch and then from there uh, hit that power button on the um, on the keyboard <clears throat> and then it would just turn on the laptop and then I can just, just go right back into, you know, whatever I was watching and so forth. So, all right, hope this video helped you a little bit random, but, um, yeah, definitely check out that, the Logitech, uh, wireless keyboard because that's one of the coolest options that it, that's one of my favorite wireless keyboards that I've purchased where it has the option of putting the computer in the hibernation mode and then also skipping tracks, um, you know, pausing it, turning the volume up and down and so forth. So um, pretty nifty, doesn't cost that much, but it's definitely my preferred keyboard to use. So, all right, that's all I have for today. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Later.